Welcome back guys. Today I'm going to show you what I keep inside my med kit. Now that it's open up, you see we got quite a few things in here. Now that I got it all laid out for you guys, I'm just going to briefly go over each item. This is a med kit that I put together myself of collecting stuff over time. Right here we got some latex gloves which is just good to protect your hands and keep the wound sanitary that you're working on. We got an elastic bandage for sprains or whatever you got to bandage. Just some gauze pads, multiple sizes. Uh, assortment of tweezers, surgical scissors, well like shears, and a fold-up pair. These right here are water purification tabs. And then we got some duct tape, because you always need duct tapes. Glow stick for whatever singling, signaling you gotta do. Some chapstick. Always important to have a tourniquet. Multiple uses for that. Bug bite relief, any biotic ointment. Some earplugs and waterproof tape. Got a stethoscope. This is just one of those dollar store med kits just for like the band-aids in it and I add in some of my own band-aids. Iodine swab, blister medic, quick clot, stops the bleeding fast, a poncho, some more gauze, some rolled gauze, some elastic bandaging, some sewing thread, hand sanitizer, fire starter, and an emergency whistle. In the more inner pocket of that med kit, I had some more gauzes and some face masks. That is where I keep my med kit and it still allows the table to fold up and down. Besides the med kit on the back, I also make sure to keep med kits up front just in case uh, you just need a quick band-aid with like alcohol swabs and stuff in there to sterilize so I keep the little plastic one like I had in the back I keep one of them in the glove box I keep a ziploc bag full of bandages and gloves and stuff of that nature under the passenger seat and under the driver's seat as well I also picked up one of these little first aid kits which has multiple stuff inside I'll open it up for you it's got quite a few things inside it's got a uh, whistle and a compass, uh, antiseptic, wound wipes, bandages. It has a whole count of stuff on the back of the exact amount and the exact thing, but dressings, tape, bandages for sh sprains, uh, sp splinter, pick and tick removal, antibiotic ointment, afterbite, ibuprofen, antihistamines, acetaphrine, and aspirin. So this was only like 20 bucks if you don't want to make your own med kit and you just want to pick some up quick. But I keep multiple med kits in here because I'm always using stuff out of them and you got to make sure always to replace what you use in your med kit. But this stays in my center console. But besides that, med kit's always handy to have in the car whether you're on a long road trip, whether you're off-road on the trails and not medical supplies around you, um, camping, hiking, whatever it may be, it's always good to have a good med kit on board for whatever your journey brings. I hope this gave you some ideas of stuff to put in your med kit, or if not, gave you the idea to put a med kit in your car or off-road vehicle. All right, I hope you found this useful. If you did and would like to see more videos about specific gear that I carry, please give this a thumbs up. Thank you all.